After backlash from parents, students, and alumni, the Kansas City Public School District delayed its vote on a new Blueprint 2030 plan. Tonight, the revised version will be presented. Yeah, the original blueprint called for the closure of 10 schools, and right now, the district is without a permanent superintendent. Fox 4's Malik Jackson is live outside KCPS headquarters. And Malik, this is what a lot of folks in the community have been waiting for since day one when that plan was first brought to their attention. Yeah, good evening, Chris Stell and John. That is exactly 100% correct. And their chief concern is that nothing in this plan they felt will directly improve student academics. And within the last couple of hours, the school district has released uh, 21 strategic goals moving forward that they plan on introducing at tonight's meeting. Those goals mainly focused on improving student achievement, although it doesn't exactly say how they will do this, besides saying they will get it done. As you mentioned at the top, the original plan was to close 10 schools, including Central High School. That idea was the foundation of much of the frustration in and around this communities. Tonight's meeting will be district administrating administration, excuse me, presenting the revised plan. Parents or students will not have the opportunity to chime in. Something sparked Bookhart, the executive director of the Parent Power Lab, who works on the front lines when the school doors are closed, says has been the problem from the get go. Not enough input from those directly affected by these moves. A little unfortunate. I think we have a lot of a lot more opportunity to engage community in um, a more robust way before um, we laid out before these um, recommendations were laid out. And I think that um, because that wasn't done, you know, you have a lot of ill will and a lot of ill feeling in the community that probably could have be, been prevented. And the fear here in this community is that this will create a similar situation that we saw in 2010, where the school district closed nearly half of the buildings, half of the schools, and a year later they lost their accreditation. Now, on the 25th of this month, that will be the opportunity where parents and students will get the opportunity to chime in on this revised plan. Again, this meeting starting tonight at 6:30. Fox 4's Dave DeMarco will be inside and will bring you live updates tonight on Fox 4 News at 9 and 10.